Hey, I want to share a dream with you. So in this dream, I'm at an Airbnb and it's huge. There's a ton of rooms, there's a lot of common areas, and I was working on cleaning up the kitchen. We were trying to get out of there. And I'm looking around and it's 11 o'clock and checkout was 11 o'clock. And I'm going, where is everybody? And I go to people's bedrooms and I walked into one and the person is scrubbing the bathroom. And I'm like, you don't need to do that. I need help in these common areas. Sweeping needs to be done. Trash needs to be taken out. Like the kitchen's done, but I need help. And so I go into someone else's bedroom and they had made their bed in such a way that it was absolutely perfect, right? Better than when they had checked in. And so I start calling everybody. I'm like, guys, let's go. Things don't have to be perfect for you to get out here and help. And so then everyone starts pitching in and I was like, we're going to be late checking out, but that's okay. You know, I'll, I'll just call the owner of the Airbnb and let her know we'll be out of here in the next half hour and it'll be fine. So then I go into my own room and I see a couple articles hanging up in this alcove. It wasn't really a closet. It was like an alcove. And I was like, oh my gosh, I was so worried about the common areas and trying to make sure that everyone's okay. I almost missed some of my clothes. So then I wake up and I'm laying there like, what was that? So then I go to council and I'm talking to them and I'm like, well, help me here. You know, what are you showing me? You know, I said, is it just the simple message of I was so busy, you know, making sure that the kitchen was clean that I almost forgot my own stuff. What is this message here? And they said to me, they said, it's time for the second waivers to step up. It's time for them to start assisting, doing more, creating more, living the life that they want to live, even if it's in increments. So then they said to me, they said, there are so many that are ready, but they, they think that they have to be perfect, perfectly healed, perfectly groomed, look a certain way. They want to make sure everything is just in place. They don't feel trained enough. They don't feel ready enough. And the truth is bullshit. You're ready. And you know who you are as I'm talking to you. You're ready. Your fears may not be ready. Your inner child may not be ready. But you are ready. Step up. Assist. Be who you truly are. You do not have to be perfect. So they said, see, what if you hadn't done any of this work because you still have items hanging in your closet? And they're not wrong. I've got items, you've got items, we all do. So don't let those things stop you. It's time, find your way and you've got this.